Alrighty, Lumberjacks, welcome back to another single player episode. Uh, this time around, we're going to keep uh, rolling with the trees here, chopping down some stuff. Uh, one thing I do want to do before we get started is I want to set up set up our false stakes here. Well, they're sort of false, I guess you could say. False-ish. Oops. And I'm just trying to juggle the juggle my wood here, alright? <laughs> That's what we're doing today. There we go. There we go, perfect. Oh, it doesn't look perfect, but it'll hold. And we're gonna do the same on this one. I'm sure you could kind of whip it a bit. So, actually, here, let's go this way. There we go. So, one there, and I think we'll put the other one like here, can we? I'm gonna put it right on the edge so we got space there. There we go, perfect. There we go. Now we got... Oh, jeez. <laughs> Look what happened there. That's neat. Whatever. It's all good. So, that's our uh, our loading bed. At least we got kind of a kind of a setup there. Uh, I'm going to keep roasting down some of these trees. I don't go deaf from my own socks. I have my volume cranked up way too high. Oh, that's not so bad. Oh, I know what I forgot to do. One sec here. I forgot to set our timer. There we go. We'll have a couple free minutes on this one. Uh, is that a small tree? Well, it's kind of smallish. I like I said, I wanted to, I want to cut down the big trees too, but um, I want to make a little bit more money first, and then we can rent out that weird-looking little processor thing there and uh, test it out. Should be fun. All right, chop this. And we'll cut it about here. And I'm just gonna, I'm not really care, I'm just gonna pile it over here. We don't wanna get too crazy on our details here. Oh, that's like a, a really tiny tree. I bet that'll fit on there, I don't think I have to cut that one. I didn't know there was another medium sized tree. There we go. Oh, fly like the wind. All right, okay, so um, we got a bunch here, a bunch there. I'm going to take down this guy. Basically just doing kind of the roadside stuff right now. And then once we start knocking stuff down with that other processor, we'll try to bring it in road as much as possible. Because that thing's going to cost a lot of money to operate, I can tell you right now. Especially if we lease it. If we lease it, we're going to be fighting... Fighting cash flow all day. But also we'll be able to make some crazy production with it too. Uh, oops, what am I doing? Where's my tree? Oh, didn't, didn't we cut two down? I thought there was another one. Oh, well, maybe not. We'll just keep chopping these ones. Look at this nice little scenic park bench thing they got going on over here. Too bad we have to knock down the whole forest, hey? Oh, well. Oops. And that's why you don't ride the trees while they're falling, kids. There we go. Perfect. That's kind of a small one here. <clears throat> I'm excited to get that processor. That's going to be fun. Then we'll be logging like madmen. We'll just drive it up here. There's no point in getting a trailer for that. Trying to be cost effective since we're so close to our logging site. Now, if we had a far distance logging site, then I'd uh, I'd have no choice but to buy a low bed. But we're not that far from home, so this works out pretty good. Now we get this one too. And then I think I'm just going to start loading because um, we only have... $368 in the bank, so I kind of want to get on that. Throw some extra money in there, because I know things are going to catch up. And then we're going to have to start worrying about things like fuel and stuff too soon, so... I just want a little bit of revenue happening, so let's, uh, let's jump in this bad boy. Oh man, I forgot about using this thing. Oh right, yeah, we do this. That's right. And we're going to go about there. Whoop. 
There we go. Beauty. Just gotta find <clears throat> our center point here. That's about good there, I think. Bloop. Sweet. Got some shorts there too, and some shorts up there. Here a short, there a short, everywhere a short. It'll be good. Okay, here we go. Oh, let's see if we can tilt that down. It's like automatically tilts back up. It's really weird. Must be like some kind of down pressure you think it gets. I uh, wonder if I can grab these on an angle here. Let's try. You get them all? Oh, yeah. Eh, we can grab a little bit more to the center. Get them right about there. There we go. Wouldn't say it's like perfectly straight. Oh, maybe we didn't. Uh... Oh, we did trim it. I thought we left the end on there. I'm like, what the heck? Oh, that's good for the equipment. And let's put it right about here. Kind of build ourselves a little nest in there. Oh. Stupid things keep dropping down, I forget. I want to pull this one back a little bit, but apparently that log's too heavy. There we go. And that's what I wanted. Okay, so now we should be able to close it and then just push it forward. There we go. Good enough for me. Alright, let's get this other one up on this hill here. And then everything else is at least kind of on the ground, so that'll be good. I'll just grab this one by itself. This gets kind of an oblong one. If I can get it, that is. Oh, come on. I guess that's considered gotten. It's just so crazy logging like this. I don't know why it just seems bizarre. I wouldn't say it's completely inefficient. I mean, we're making pretty good time with this thing. But there's definitely faster ways to log for sure. Once we get the money, we'll be logging like pros. Definitely want to get this, uh, definitely get this thing loaded up. I don't think we'll have enough time in the video to bring it to the mill but we'll uh, definitely get at least partially if not mostly loaded actually let's grab this little guy here first then we will readjust and grab this other one right in the center spot oh you can't really grab it center because that thing's in the way there we go let's try that Oh, come on. Why you gotta be like this, Loda? There we go. Oh man, they're a little, uh... They're a little off-kilter there. So we'll see how loading that goes. Actually, you know what I would like to try? Watch this. Let's see if we can do this. I wanna try to use this tree to bump it in. Let's see if we can do this. Aw, oh, it's too tight. Darn. I was gonna see if I could uh, bump it against that tree to make it... Make it go in. Put this one on there first. And then let's fix this one now. There we go. Let's 
Sort of something like that, yeah? Huh? Why not? Alright, let's grab a couple more here. Grab these two and one. And... Presto. Maneuverability. There we go. Go out here, get a view of the world. Sorry, I'm like, whenever I load, I swear to God, I get like uber focused because I want to make sure I'm doing it right. And then I don't talk as much. But like I said, maybe it's not a, uh, maybe it's not a bad thing. Maybe it's good. Oop. Those ones are a little bit longer, so we're going to go this way a bit more. There we go. There. Oop. Let's, uh, actually what I'd like to do is maybe slide this one down on the flat part. Right about there. What I'm trying to do is make another sort of a cradle again, like we had before, so I can just pile in those little, those little logs. But, in order to make the cradle, right, we got to space it out. I think this one will fit right in here. Sorry, I'm just watching my other monitor here trying to see how close I am to that edge. Right about there. Oh, darn. She popped off there. There we go. Let's see here. So, okay, I got an idea here. Let's see if I can, I just wanna get that butt end in there because that's the part that's not playing nice. Basically that end is what I'm trying to just tip in there. So now that that end's in, I can probably loosen this end and then pop that side in. Now what I might do is I'm just going to lock it down while it's there. It's kind of the position I want it to be. Perfect. Alright. So this video is going to run a little bit later because I want to grab these other two or one logs that we got here. Um, and then on the next video when we come back, I guess, uh, what I'll do is I'll grab all those shorts and I'll trickle, trickle them on top and we'll take the load to the mill. So that we can be rich again or think we're rich. <laughs> Let's get this one on there. I basically just want to build it so this uh, cradle's all nice and easy for us to access. So when we do pile on the shorts, it'll be a painless procedure. So let's put this one kind of to the back here. Well, that was a cool flip. Do you see that? Badass. Oh, yeah. You got one more over here. Let me grab this one, too. We'll make this a treacherously, treacherously big load. There we go. Yeah, some of my videos run a little bit later just because I want to get a couple things done in them, so. And then I relock the load again, I think. Put this one in place. Right about there, I think. Maybe we'll bring it forward a little bit. Sure, that'll be good. Let's do the quick lock there. Now, we've built ourselves a beautiful cradle. So now we can uh, grab all those shorts and just pile them in there. Look at that, beautiful. 
that's uh, that's a piece of masterpiece work right there. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna end this video here. Um, if you guys like the video, leave a like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe, and if you're in the bush, don't forget to hug a tree. All right, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.